Hello, this is uh, iCat. Inside the iCat, I have to take this plastic off because uh, it was in the way. And this uh, joystick is have LED light. It's real pretty. The problem is real long. And you and this is the whole size for one joystick for USB. These other four are the auto, uh, turbo, clear, and and uh, we. Let me say it again. <laughs> auto, turbo. Uh, clear and again is uh, clear the turbo reset and then LED light and then two pin for the the joystick for the left right up down and I have a, a five pin uh, joystick so I don't I don't use the two pin use the five and this have the same address as this so I cannot use a use that as analog I was thinking about using that as analog. You know how the Xbox have two, uh, you know, uh, analog joystick. I was thinking about using one as joystick, one as analog, but I can't. They both have the same address. So by using this, using this is the same. So, so that, so there's no need for that. This is for the, I guess another way to power it up. But here's the power, and it has the USB power cable. So I happen to have a hole here because. This thing hold. This thing have a little uh, little plastic that is is that is keeping me from able to put this other two button. As I use it for reset. So let me flip it over. I have a problem where the joystick. Uh, I cut it enough to where you know it's easy to cut, but it's almost like a one finger thickness up. But turn now it's hitting the joystick, and when you hit it against here, uh, problem is. If you push against this, this button, when you try to push, it doesn't work. So for example, right now it's clicking, and if I push against it, and I click, it doesn't click. See, it's stuck. So I look on my thumb, it click. So if I push against this too, it, does, it doesn't click. So I have to turn this more of a diagonal, uh, more of a diagonal like that, and then, and then, uh, when you push against on top of this, it doesn't it doesn't kick, cause this to not click. So I have to cut a piece off of the plastic, uh, so that way this joystick when I close it, it doesn't hit the it doesn't hit it because right now this plastic right now it will hit it, and then I can shut it. So that that become a problem for me. And I have to fight with this plastic right here. It, it hit it when I close it. So now we're cutting it. It, it helps. So I could close this up at least, and that that little thing that that hold the uh, iPad, I cut I I took the plastic off, and then then I have to I want to install the start and select button right there where the hole is, so that way I don't have to worry about trying to cover it up. It's just exactly the uh, right side for it, and I think the joystick is a 24 uh, centimeter thick width, and this joystick is real pretty. It it have color and doesn't make a lot of clicking noise like the iCat the original one does the yeah, iCat and it's made by ION company and so uh, I'm ready to put glue on it and put all the screw in it and then we're gonna put a monitor on this and hopefully everything will be good all right hope that helped and I'll show you the next video once I put the monitor on this <laughs> so in the back if you flip it around there's like 10 screw yet to screw back in it's one, two, and three. Okay, and then four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then the last one is the very bottom. Probably want to see it because it's dark. So you put all the screw in, and then you could uh, plug it in. You see, I cut this hole out because uh, it's creating where I cannot put this two button. So I use the hole for the power cable. So it'll be just right, the USB. Okay, and then uh, we're going to go ahead and put it together. The button light up. It's cool. This 25 cents light lit up. And both the light on the side work now.